everyone, I'm Jen Myers of Hello Hoboken, and today I am up in the heights at 107 Bowers Gallery and Art Space. So not only is this a local gallery, but it's also a hub for so many other creative endeavors. Launching the gallery in September of 2016, owner Kristen DeAngelis wanted a place that embraced the creative journey through advocacy, education, and outreach. It's here where artists are able to connect with one another and the community. And today we're going to be checking out one of Kristen's young master art classes and we'll get to meet some pretty cool kiddos. So Kristen, let's start from the beginning. What made you want to open this gallery? Like you started in the corporate world, you were in sales, marketing for what, 20 years? For a long time. But oh. no, for a very long time. Don't <laughs> tell your age, what are you talking about? <laughs> she started really anyway, young. Yeah, I'm so young. So, um, well, I've always been an artist, and so that was always in my background. And when I moved to the Jersey City area, I really wanted to get back involved being an artist and working with children and doing a lot of things that I wasn't doing in my corporate life. So it was a volunteer opportunity upon a volunteer opportunity, and it just kind of snowballed. And then the space opened up, and we thought, okay, well, let's invest in Jersey City because we were already yeah. so invested in it. And then it became a gallery, and we just moved forward, and I wanted to have kids' art classes. So we've been teaching here for about a year and a half, and it's been great. And not only are you here at 107 Bowers, but you're also you also teach community classes and things yes. like that as well. So I also teach a community class at the Bethune Center. So that's on Tuesdays, um, and that's open to the same age range, you know, seven to twelve year old children, and it's an hour long class. We do two classes here at 107 Bowers Gallery. So there's Friday afternoon class, which is about an hour and fifteen minutes, and then our Saturday morning classes, which are about two hours. So we tend to teach the same sort of lessons, you just scale it to the timing and Absolutely. for the better students you have. And you do like different things every totally. week, different every, classes. Yes, mm -hmm. everything is different, everybody needs the project, so it's really exciting. They get to see what they've made. We do all of our first time students get a hat. You go crazy. You sketch. A minute, yeah. What's your favorite project you've done so far in class? Um, what do you think? The exploding poop. The what? So the exploding what? It exploding poop. So it's kind of like 3D. So we'll take a balloon cover in newspaper and then we have to let it dry and then we pop the balloon inside and then we paint it. That's so cool. So Cheryl Gross is an artist. She also teaches. She's an um, art educator. She teaches at Pratt Institute. She does a lot of things with watercolor. I think this is a Mexican because it has a hat and mm -hmm. he lives in Mexico. Okay. Maybe. Maybe. Or maybe it could be a potato chip that we <laughs> talked about mm -hmm. right now. And the, this could be the world. So today we we're not going to use coffee. Yeah. We're going to take some watercolor. We're going to try to mix a little bit of color and yeah, no, just a little bit on Yay. our paper. Yay! A little bit on our paper, and then we're going to draw from that. I 
I had so much fun in this art class today, and I mean, in just two hours, look what I've done. Isn't this gorgeous? And you can't even get it, because I already sold it for $70,000, guys. <laughs> like, I'm a big deal now. Just kidding. This is actually by a local artist, Swati Rastogi. Uh, you can find her work and a bunch of other local artists here at Bowers Gallery. So for more information, go to 107bowersgallery.com to find out more info on, you know, private birthday parties, kids' classes, and more events. See you later.